if you look here we're given two exterior angles and one interior angle we are asked to find these two angles here how can we find them let's first label them angle p and angle q consider this triangle here you know the sum of angles in a triangle is equal to 180 degrees so we can form an equation here that 100 degree plus p plus q is equal to 180 degree so that means this 100 degree can cross the equal sign and go back to the other side so we have p plus q is equal to 180 degree minus 100 degree 180 degree minus 100 degree is 80 degree so p plus q now is 80 degree keep the equation aside we're going to use it later let's come back to this 4x here if you look 4x and angle p are on the same straight line and we know the sum of angles on a straight line is equal to 180 degree as well so we can also form an equation here that 4x plus p is equal to 180 degree come back here as well if you look this is 3x and this is angle q this also a straight line we can also form the equation 3x plus q is equal to 180 degree what do we do now these are two similar equations we can add them up together 4x plus 3x is 7x plus p plus q write it down which equals to 180 degree plus 180 degree is 360 degree so 7x plus p plus q is equal to 360 degree 7x num plus if you look here p plus q is 80 degree from this equation here so we can substitute it here and say 7x plus 80 degree is equal to 360 7x is now equal to 360 degree minus 80 degree which is equal to 280 so 7x is now equal to 280 but to find the exact value of x now we have to divide 280 by 7 to get an answer so x is equal to 280 degree divided by 77 press your calculator x is equal to 40 degree so we found the value of x from this place now we are we are to find the value of p and q now let's come back to this equation 4x plus p is equal to 180 degree we found the value of x to be 40 degree so we can substitute the value here 4 into 40 degree plus p is equal to 180 degree 4 times 4 degree is 4 times 40 degree is 160 degree plus p which equals to 180 degree p now is equal to 180 degree minus 160 degree which equal to 20 degree so p is equal to 20 degree now to find angle q we can use this equation here and we can also use this equation here let's use this one that says 3x plus q is equal to 180 degree so to do the value of x which is 40 degree 3 into 40 degree plus q is equal to 180 degree 3 times 40 degree is 120 degree plus q which is equal to 180 degree q is now equal to 180 degree minus 120 degree q is equal to 180 degree minus 120 degree is 60 degree so simple and straightforward please subscribe to my channel